Hi everyone, I'm Heather Dawson and welcome to California Live where we show you the best of California every week on our show. So let's start off with a quick trip to the Coachella Valley for a spotlight staycation in beautiful Palm Springs. Fly me to Palm the Springs moon. is hot these days Let in more ways than one. It's blessed with 354 star. days of sunshine a year, Let and the Hollywood glamour makes the place sizzle even after the sun has set. It's only two hours from L.A. or short flight from San Francisco. Words, the drama begins the moment you arrive and get a load of Mount San Jacinto towering over the city. At its base is Palm Canyon Drive, the strip as it's known in town, packed with shops and restaurants the Spa Casino, and a great street fair called Village Fest on Thursday nights. Plus, you won't want to miss the fabulous Palm Springs Follies, a hilarious Vegas-style variety show where the showgirls range in age from 56 to 81. At North Palm Canyon has now become a destination for those who appreciate the color and sparkle of mid-century modern design. One of the hippest, most popular restaurants in town, Trio, anchors the Uptown Design District at 707 North Palm Canyon Drive. Everyone talks about Trio. Trio's a place to go. Oh, we gotta go to Trio. Have you heard about Trio? It gives me goosebumps because it makes me feel good that people talk about a restaurant like that. They have one of the best deals in town, a $19 three-course meal from 4 to 6 p.m. So, what's in the name, Trio? Trio Restaurant is food, art, and music food because that's what we're all about, art because we love art, music because we want that high energy to go with it all. The fabulousness continues at the storied Riviera Resort, where the 60s glitz has come roaring back to life after a massive renovation in 2008. It was once a poolside playground to the stars. It was even the setting for the 1963 hit movie Palm Springs Weekend with Troy Donahue and Connie Stevens. Their mirrored lounge takes you back to a slightly naughty version of the Mad Men era. Palm Springs is famous for the wealth of mid-century modern architecture. Perhaps the best-known example is the Kaufman House, built in 1946, designed by Richard Neutra and owned in the 70s by singer Barry Manilow. Spend two hours with celebrity tours and they will whisk you around Palm Springs to check out homes once owned by Frank Sinatra, Marilyn Monroe, Liberace and Dean Martin, and then there's the Honeymoon Hideaway made famous by newlyweds Elvis and Priscilla Presley. Of course, every year in January, the Palm Springs International Film Festival brings out Hollywood's A-listers of today. But Tinseltown aside, Palm Springs is also a great time for families and outdoorsy types. The tram with its cars that rotate 360 degrees offers unparalleled views. The golf is top-notch, and the Indian canyons, with their waterfalls, sheer cliffs, and ancient rock art, transport you to another world. All around Palm Springs is a lovely, carefree, sun-drenched getaway. Bringing you the best of California from Palm Springs, I'm Suzanne Pajot for California Life.